How's it going everybody? I wanted to hop on really quick. I'm still here in Animal Kingdom tonight, but I wanted to hop on real quick and kind of give my thoughts on uh, Avatar, uh, Pandora, the land of Avatar. Just got out of my annual pass preview for that. Uh, I didn't do any video coverage. I didn't do any filming. Um, I got a little bit of a clip. Actually, I got a little bit of a clip on the Navi River uh, journey of the Shaman animatronic, which uh, for starters uh, is massive. It's huge. I think it's easily seven feet, seven and a half feet tall. It's huge. It's true to life to the movie, so it's massive. So the video you've seen is like, oh man, that thing's so fluid and smooth and so realistic. It's also like almost eight feet tall. It's huge. It's huge. Uh, honestly, just kind of go over the whole thing. Uh, the land itself is absolutely gorgeous. I wish I had gotten a chance to uh, see it at night with all the bioluminescent stuff, but that's okay. Uh, our previews ended before sundown, so we uh, we weren't able to see any of the bioluminescent stuff. So I'll have to see that a little bit later um, after Avatar is officially open. Um, but the environment itself is pretty. I got some great shots with my camera, which takes really, really good, vivid, very colorful, very bright nature sh and nature shots. So I got some really pretty pictures that I'll be able to put online uh, for you guys to see. Um, really really pretty stuff um ride wise the navi river adventure is really fun it's kind of slow there's not really a lot going on on there there's some projection stuff really pretty it's all bioluminescent so it's all really glow and really neon bright colorful and then of course there's the shaman animatronic which is just worth the whole ride itself she's at the very end but it's it's worth the entire ride itself uh i did get to eat i ate at i think it's called shunli canteen uh, I got the, they have an option where you can get a bowl uh, and it, you pick different things that go in it. I got the grilled chicken with the red and sweet potato hash. With the sauce I got was the chimichurri, I believe that's how it said, how it said chimichurri sauce. Um, it might be my new favorite Disney meal. It was amazing. Huge portion. Uh, and I got really, I got full off of it. Uh, then I got dessert. I got the, I think it was the blueberry, uh, the blueberry cheesecake with uh, passion fruit. It was amazing. Oh my god! It's the if you haven't seen a picture of it, it's the looks like a blue ball. It's real shiny and glittery and bright and colorful. Uh, it tastes awesome. It looks like that on the outside. When you cut into it, it actually looks like cheesecake on the inside. So don't be worried about what it looks like. Don't get over what it looks like. Um, I might have gone back actually and gotten it a second time. Yeah, I did. I totally did. I went back and got it in another one because it was so so good. Uh, but the big thing I'm going to talk about is uh, Flight of Passage, or since what everybody's calling the Banshee Ride. Holy moly! My God, it's like Soren on crack. It's it's like it, that's how you really put it. It's like Soren on crack. Uh, you go through a, you go through two different pre-shows. There's the first is like a, a decon, uh, it's actually a decontamination. They blow you with air and all this stuff, and then they match you with an avatar. And the second one actually tells you what an avatar is and shows you actually how to get on the ride vehicle. Essentially, it's like a, it's like a motorcycle. You get on it like a bike and you slide up. The restraints come back. Uh, I was worried about body requirements and stuff like that, but I ended up being okay because it was. Um, I and mean, like I said, I was worried about body stuff. So, um, but I ended up being okay. Um, I got, uh, it was a little tight squeeze on the back because there's a restraint that comes up in the back and there's restraints on your legs. But it was a little tight squeeze on my back, but I was able to slide up a little bit more and get a little bit more comfortable. Sorry, somebody's taking a picture over here. So I wanted to slide over and give them a little room. Um, but uh, I, it's soaring, but you can't see the edges of the screen. It is a seamless, endless, I mean, infinity screen. It is massive, it's beautiful. I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous. It is by far the most technologically advanced ride Disney has put in the American parks. It is fantastic. This thing's gonna have a line for years, years and years and years to come. It's amazing. So if you're planning on coming down to DAC and doing some of the Pandora stuff, it opens on May 27th, make sure you hit it up. It's gonna be fantastic. Uh, I can't wait to go back and ride the Banshee ride and I can't go wait to go back and get some more of that food. My god that food was good So until next time guys watch your step